types of chemical reactions. A combination reaction is one in which two or more reactants combine to form a single product. Combustion of coal and reaction of calcium oxide with water C plus O2 gives CO2. CaO plus H2O gives CaOH2. Decomposition reactions are those in which a substance splits into two or more simpler substances. The thermal decomposition of calcium carbonate CaCO3 gives CaO plus CO2. Combustion reaction is the burning of a substance in the presence of oxygen resulting in the release of energy. Combustion of ethylene gas Equation for oxidation of ethylene Oxidation reaction involves the addition of oxygen or the removal of hydrogen from a substance. Rusting and rancidity are two examples of oxidation reaction. Coating iron articles with enamel, paint or red lead oxide prevents rust. Reduction reaction involves addition of hydrogen or removal of oxygen from a substance. Photosynthesis is a reduction reaction. Oxidation and reduction reactions occurring together are known as redox reactions. Examples for a redox reaction Equation for reaction of copper oxide with hydrogen Chemical reactions in which energy is released are known as exothermic reactions and those which include absorption of energy are known as endothermic reactions. Balancing of Equation 1 A chemical reaction involves a change in the physical and chemical properties, the composition and the physical state of a substance. A chemical equation is a symbolic representation of the reactants and the products using their chemical formulae. A chemical equation contains reactants, products, an arrow separates the reactants and products. Symbols for physical state of reactants and products Solid S Liquid L Gas G Aqua solution AQ Gas produced Precipitate formed Direction of reaction Types of chemical reactions Decomposition reactions Chemical decomposition or breakdown 
is the separation of a chemical compound into elements or simpler compounds. The stability that a chemical compound ordinarily has is eventually limited when exposed to extreme environmental conditions like heat, radiation, humidity or the acidity of a solvent. Let us do an activity. Take about 2 gram lead nitrate powder in a boiling tube. Hold the boiling tube with a pair of tongs and heat it over a flame. You will observe the emission of brown fumes. These fumes are of nitrogen dioxide, NO2. The reaction that takes place is 2 Pb NO3 2 S Heat gives 2 PbO S plus 4 NO2 G plus O2 G. Let us do another activity. Take about 2 gram silver chloride in a china dish. Place this china dish in sunlight for some time. The color of the silver chloride turns gray after some time. This is due to the decomposition of silver chloride into silver and chlorine by light. 2 AgCl S Sunlight gives 2 Ag S plus Cl2 G We can see that the decomposition reactions require energy either in the form of heat, light or electricity for breaking down the reactants. Types of chemical reactions Displacement reaction A displacement reaction is a type of reaction where part of one reactant is replaced by another reactant. Let us understand it by doing an activity. Take three iron nails and clean them by rubbing with sandpaper. Take two test tubes. In each test tube, take about 10 ml copper sulphate solution. Tie two iron nails with a thread and immerse them carefully in the copper sulphate solution in test tube B for about 20 minutes. Keep one iron nail aside for comparison. After 20 minutes, take out the iron nail from the copper sulphate solution. You will notice iron nail becomes brownish in color and the blue color of copper sulphate solution fades. Fe S plus CuSO4 Aq gives FeSO4 Aq plus CuS. In this reaction, iron has displaced or removed another element copper from copper sulphate solution. This reaction is known as displacement reaction. Types of chemical reactions Double displacement reaction Displacement reaction is of two types. 1. Single displacement reaction. 2. Double displacement reaction. 
Single displacement is when one element changes places with another element in a compound. These reactions come in the general form of A plus BC gives AC plus B. One example of a single displacement reaction is when magnesium replaces hydrogen in water to make magnesium hydroxide and hydrogen gas. Mg plus 2H2O gives MgOH2 plus H2. Double displacement is when the anions and cations of two different molecules switch places forming two entirely different compounds. These reactions are in the general form AB plus CD gives AD plus CB. One example of a double displacement reaction is the reaction of lead 2 nitrate with potassium iodide to form lead 2 iodide and potassium nitrate. PbNO3 2 plus 2Ki gives PbI2 plus 2KNO3. Let us do an activity. Take about 3 ml of sodium sulphate solution in a test tube. In another test tube, take about 3 ml of barium chloride solution. Mix the two solutions. You will observe that a white substance which is insoluble in water is formed. This insoluble substance formed is known as a precipitate. Any reaction that produces a precipitate can be called a precipitation reaction. Na2SO4 Aq plus BaCl2 Aq gives BaSO4 S plus 2NaCl AQ Types of chemical reactions Oxidation and Reduction Let us start with an activity. Heat a china dish containing about 1 gram copper powder. The surface of copper powder becomes coated with black copper 2 oxide. This is because oxygen is added to copper and copper oxide is formed. Cu plus O2 heat gives 2 CuO. If hydrogen gas is passed over this heated material, CuO, the black coating on the surface turns brown as the reverse reaction takes place and copper is obtained. CuO plus H gives Cu plus H2O. If a substance gains oxygen during a reaction, it is said to be oxidized. If a substance loses oxygen during a reaction, it is said to be reduced. During this reaction, the copper 2 oxide is losing oxygen and is being reduced. The hydrogen is gaining oxygen and is being oxidized. In other words, one reactant gets oxidized while the other gets reduced during a reaction. Such reactions are called 
oxidation reduction reaction or redox reactions. Types of chemical reactions exothermic reaction and endothermic reaction. In chemistry, there are two types of reactions involving a redistribution of energy, exothermic and endothermic reactions. In an exothermic chemical reaction, energy or heat is released. As an exothermic reaction occurs, its energy is released into its environment. The products of an exothermic reaction have less heat than the reactants. The majority of reactions that occur in everyday situations are exothermic in nature. A few examples of exothermic chemical reactions include liquid water freeze to form ice, water vapor condenses into dew or raindrops and the oxidation of a metal forms rust. Explosion caused by weapons or engines are strong exothermic reactions. In an endothermic chemical reaction, energy or heat is absorbed. Over the course of an endothermic reaction, the reacting system takes energy from its surroundings to produce a reaction. The products of an endothermic reaction have more heat than the reactants. Some examples of endothermic chemical reactions include ice cubes melting into liquid water, liquid water evaporating and becomes water vapor, and a cake baked in an oven. Water states of matter are the clearest way to compare exothermic and endothermic reactions. As water moves from a solid to a liquid or from a liquid to a gas, the process is endothermic. When water condenses from a gas to a liquid, or when liquid water freezes, the reaction is exothermic.